Hi, my name is Andrew, I'm a technology expert at the Human Manual. In this tutorial, we'll show you how to connect to a Bluetooth Magic Trackpad. You may be familiar with Bluetooth technology on your mobile or smartphone device, whereby you can traditionally connect wireless headsets, which are now a part of the legal requirements for driving and talking on your mobile phone here in the UK. Well, now Bluetooth can be used for many other things. Essentially, Bluetooth technology allows you to connect to another device wirelessly, just like a mouse, a magic trackpad, keyboard, and much more. We'll now show you how to connect to your Bluetooth Magic Trackpad. Here we have the Apple Bluetooth Magic Trackpad. Using the power button at the side of the Magic Trackpad, we will turn it on. The light will flash after a few seconds. Now switch on your Bluetooth on your Mac, either by clicking on the Bluetooth icon found on your menu bar or by going into the System Preferences menu. Once you're in with System Preferences, you need to go and look for the Internet and Wireless section and then click on Bluetooth. As you can see, I have a few devices listed here and my Bluetooth is switched on. To add a new device, I can either click this plus icon just here or I can choose, if I wanted to, click on the Bluetooth icon and then click on Set up new device. Immediately, your Apple Mac computer will begin searching for some new devices. It may take a few moments for your Bluetooth device to be found. As you can see, we here now have our Bluetooth device come up and you may get a pop-up which looks just like this, asking you to confirm a pairing request. Please click Yes. Click on the device and then click on Continue. It's now going to attempt to pair with your trackpad. After a few moments, you should see a congratulations screen, confirming that your computer and your trackpad are now set up. To set up a new device, please click on Set up another device, otherwise please click Quit. As you can see, I have my keyboard, my trackpad and my mouse all connected to my Apple Mac computer. I've already renamed my trackpad, whereas yours may just say trackpad. To rename this, please click on it now. Now click on the options or the settings cog found at the bottom of the white box and then click on rename. Now enter your desired name and then click rename. By renaming your trackpad whenever you connect it to other Apple Mac computers, this name will then be remembered moving forwards. We have created specific tutorials for connecting your keyboard and your mouse. Have fun exploring and learning about your Apple Mac computer. We hope by now you're feeling a little more familiar and comfortable with your Apple Mac computer and don't forget to watch our other tutorials. Feel free to re-watch this video or download it for offline viewing. Please rate and provide any feedback about our video below or just email us at hello at thehumanmanualonline.com. My name is Andrew and I'm your human manual to your Apple Mac computer. Thanks for watching and bye for now.